Devri Hayamim Shani, 2 Chronicles 15. And the Ruach Elohim came upon Azariahu, the son of Obed, rather Oded, and he went out to meet Acha, and said unto him, Hear ye me, Acha, and all Yahuda and Binyamin. Yahuwah is with you, while ye be with him. And if ye seek him, he will be found of you. But if ye forsake him, he will forsake you. Now for a long season, Yashadael has been without the true Elohim and without a teaching priest, and without Torah. But when they in their trouble did turn unto Yahweh Elohai of Yashad El, and sought him, he was found of them. And in those times there was no peace to him that went out, nor to him that came in. But great vexations were upon all the inhabitants of the countries, and nation was destroyed of nation and city of city, for Elohim did vex them with all adversity. Be ye strong, therefore, and let not your hands be weak, for your work shall be rewarded. And when Acha heard these words and the prophecy of Oded the prophet, he took courage and put away the abominable idols out of all the land of Yahuda and Binyamin, and out of the cities which he had taken from Mount Ephraim, and renewed at the altar of Yahweh that was before the porch of Yahweh. And he gathered at all Yahuda and Binyamin, and the strangers with them, out of Ephraim and Manasseh, and out of Shimon, for they fell to him out of Yashadael in abundance, when they saw that Yahweh Eloheyu was with him. So they gathered themselves together at Yerushalayim in the third month, in the fifteenth year of the reign of Acha. And they offered unto Yahweh the same time of the spoil which they had brought seven hundred oxen and seven thousand sheep. And they entered into a covenant to seek at Yahweh Elohai of their fathers with all their heart and with all their soul, that whosoever would not seek Yahweh Elohim of Yashadael should be put to death, whether small or great, whether man or woman. And they swore unto Yahweh with a loud voice, and with shouting, and with trumpets, and with shofars. And all Yahuda rejoiced at the oath, for they had sworn with all their heart, and sought him with their whole desire, and he was found of them. And Yahuwah gave them rest round about. And also concerning Ma'aka, the mother of Acha, the king, he removed her from being queen, because she had made an idolatrous Asherah pole, and Acha cut down at her idol, and stamped it, and burnt it at the brook Kidran. But the high places were not taken away out of Yashodael, Nevertheless, the heart of Acha was perfect all his days. And he brought into the house of Elohim the things that his father Eth had dedicated and that he himself had dedicated, silver and gold and vessels. And there was no more war unto the five and thirteenth, rather the five and thirtieth year, of the reign of Achah.